way y'all, I finally, I finally been able to go to sleep. Like, y'all think it's a game, bro. I real life haven't been able to sleep for like the past two weeks, bro. I really haven't been able to sleep. Every time I try to do something, Kendra Lamar dropping something. If Kendra not dropping something, Drake dropping something. I'm just getting spammed 24 7. I, I'm, people, people that I don't even know is this talking junk to me, telling me, hey, be a nigga. Hey, take your, to that computer and do that video. I've been, t people been telling me that for two weeks, bro. Real talk. Real talk. But look, y'all, I think it's finally over, man. I think it's finally over. Uh, on Drake's last track, he sounded like he was defeated, bro. That was my honest opinion about that. I think Drake is burnt out, bro. I think it I think it took a lot out of Drake uh, based off the sound of that last track. But let me, I, I had to make this video, man. I could, I wouldn't be able to, to live with myself. I wouldn't be able to get a good night's rest. I'd be conflicted if I didn't say this. <laughs> Shout out J. Cole, man. Shout out J. Cole. But look, man, I got to say this right here, man. Thank you, Drizzy Drake. Thank you, Kendrick Lamar. Uh, I think Kendrick got more of a chance to see this than Drake. But thank y'all boys, man. Like, and I want to say, tell y'all thank you for a couple of reasons, man. First, I want to say thank you for, for, from hip-hop, bro. Like, hip-hop needed this. We needed this, y'all. This is one of the most iconic rap beefs ever. When you think about rap beefs, you think about Eminem, MGK. You think about Ice Cube with No Vaseline. You think about Ether with Nas. You think about Hit Em Up with Pac. You think about all those. And this one right here is right up there with those. And I say that because we got multiple tracks from two great artists, bro. Multiple. We didn't get one. We didn't get two like most of the rap beefs do. Most of them get one from each person. That's it. At the most, you'll get two. You'll get two. Out, but after two, you don't get nothing else after two. We got back and forth, back and forth. We got like three, four rounds with this beef right here. The whole internet been talking about this for the last like month, month and a half. That's all been going on. That's all you been seeing everywhere. Kendrick and Drake, Kendrick and Drake. Fans from both sides going at each other. It was beautiful. It was beautiful. And the main thing about it, nobody got hurt, y'all. Nobody got hurt. Physically, nobody, it didn't end in a tragic way. Everything was through the music. We need more, we need more of this. We need more artists getting on wax and talking they, man. We needed this for hip hop. That's why I say us fans won with this right here. Hip hop won with this right here. But the main part of this video and me saying thank you is Kendrick Lamar. What you just did, bro, you might have changed the whole game for the reaction community. Now, I'm finna show y'all this picture right here. I'm finna show y'all this picture right here. I'm gonna let y'all read it. But basically, what Kendrick Lamar did, he removed all copyright claims from all reactors, all reaction channels, whether they big, small, everybody. This is a big deal right here. And I want to be one of the first ones to say, I might not be first because I'm making this video at 2 in the morning. But I want to be one of the, the big reaction channels to speak on this. This right here is a W move for Kendrick Lamar on so many levels. Now, for people like me, Ziz and Bilu, uh, DJ Ghost, Dante, us big channels, we got we got enough pool where we can get our claims removed. I damn near get paid for all every video I put out at this point because I got connections with damn near every every label. I got some kind of connection. If I can't get the copyright removed, they already paid me up front to just react to it. They don't even tell me what to react to. 
I react to what I want to react to, and they'll pay me if they needed that promoted. It don't got to that level, man. That's why I say we blessed over here. But this ain't about me. This is about the whole reaction community. Everybody was able to eat off this beef. And for Kendra Lamar to double back and think about the reaction community and remove all copyright from his songs. Kendra Lamar is a W man's, bro. W man's. And that's a big deal because it's, it's a lot of people that smaller channels that got a lot of views from this beef. They channel got seen by a lot of people just because of this beef. And then for them to be able to get paid for what they put out, oh my God, man, you gonna inspire the next big channel by doing this. Some of us reactors made life-changing money. A lot of reactors probably made money they never made on YouTube this month. Me personally, I make a significant amount of money on, on normal days. So, for something like this to happen with me, I made a ridiculous amount of money. It's, it's insane. Like, it even blew my mind. And I done made six figures a couple times. But this right here, I, I would never put my business out there, but it's insane. Just know that. It's insane. But, uh, Kendrick Lamar, man, you a W man for this right here, man. W. Kendra Lamar, man, like for thinking about the reaction community. And if you don't get a thank you for nobody else, hear from me. I'm going to speak for the whole community. Thank you for doing this, man. Because now you done open the gate to let the labels know y'all would get promo from all these channels that done built their fan bases up. They'll be happy to react to the artists now. A lot of reactors get demotivated because we know we're going to walk in our room, react to a song, and they're going to get all the money for it. We ain't going to make nothing. That's why a lot of reactors got Patreon accounts and stuff like that because they got to make money some type of way. Me, I'm blessed enough to have the connections with the labels where I can strictly make my money off of views. Other reactors can't do that because they, they're still trying to grow. So for Kendrick to do this and put the music labels on notice that y'all can remove some of their copyright, man. Y'all can y'all can help them help y'all. We can help each other. We need the artists and the artists need us, man. And that's what I, I'm taking from this right here. Kendrick understands that. I think Kendrick understood that a lot of his songs did well like that. It's because of all the promo. He brought Ziz and Lou back. He had me re-motivated. He brought DJ Ghost back. Come on, man. Like, he brought all the OGs back. Even Flight was reacting to music, bro. So I think Kendrick understand that we need each other, man. And this is a step in the right direction right here, man. And I wanted to be the one of the, one of the few ones to speak on this and tell Kendrick, thank you. Tell Drake, thank you. Because y'all, what y'all don't understand about music labels, they're greedy. Music labels are greedy. They don't care about nothing. They gonna get their money for their content. They don't care. They don't care if you got 300 views. They copywriting it. Every time. Every time. So for Kendra to go do this at this time, Kendra could have took all the money from all the reaction channels and been lit. Kendra could have had millions just all copyright claims. But he went back and did this, man. Like, this is a W for the community. Uh, I hope all reactors got y'all a nice little bag over these past couple months, man. Uh, put your money back in your channel, man. Make your, make your content look better. Buy new cameras. Buy new mics. Reinvest in your channel with that money y'all made, man. Take care of your family with that money y'all made, bro. Facts, man. But I wanted to just speak on that. And uh, I want to tell y'all, like, we won, bro. As fans of hip-hop, we won with this beef, man. Legendary beef. Uh, shout out to all the new subscribers that we got over the past couple of weeks. We, I know for a fact we got over 200,000 new subscribers on this channel. Over 200,000 subscribers, like, within, like, two weeks, bro. It's crazy. 
But I want to thank all y'all for tuning in. Hopefully I made y'all a fan of me and not just the artists I was reacting to because that's always my goal is to make a new viewer a fan of Shaq, not who I'm reacting to. But I want to tell y'all thank you for tuning in. We got over a million views every video. So uh, we had like three, four bids hit two plus million. Crazy. Crazy. But, man, I appreciate y'all support, man. I'm going to keep going strong for y'all. We're going to keep growing. Road to five mil. Let's get it.